Have you ever looked at a guy and I thought, why does he get all the attention? Pay attention. He might not even be that. He might not look like a lovely boy, but he has a lot going on. But women are his focus. Are you interested in him? What's his secret? I will demonstrate nine effective social media strategies, skills that will make you look good to anyone. People who attract women are more than just attractive. These are not merely meaningless words. Research has demonstrated their effectiveness. There are ways to do things that will change how you engage in conversation with every woman you encounter. For those who are prepared to accept it, I have one more bonus tip for you. For the last one that most men miss. Fully, but it has the power to change. If you're ready, I'll handle everything for you. Change your life. I'm all for it. Click on the link below to view the entirety of today's event. Video. We're going to talk about what really works to get women and build strong. We're going beyond searches for links. Even more than that, often mentioned, we're sure we're going straight to stoic ideas based on real-world skills. The rules that have worked for hundreds of years ago, you might be thinking. Being silent, which sounds old-fashioned, but listen up. Stoicism is about being in charge of what you can manage. Staying calm, steady, and in charge in this world of sweeping. Trust me. These ideas about left and right are more important than ever because this is the truth. Women prefer men who can maintain relationships. Who knows themselves? And who's taught me how to talk to people on the internet on a real-world level with these nine skills? The final bonus will secure your position. In your own group, let's play the first skill. Pay attention. This is the most accurate information available. Too many guys talk about themselves. They believe that by telling everything, she likes how they're living their lives. But there's a secret she doesn't know. I want to hear about your life right away. The bat knows what she truly wants to feel. Seen and appreciated. This is where, when you listen, it's an art moment. Men are excellent at active listening, right? Just be quiet while she speaks. It's about giving what she's going through her all. Let her know that what she says matters. That means you need to put down your phone. They look at each other and nod in agreement. Being present and reacting in a way that shows that you're sincere. Are you interested? Active listening goes deeper. Furthermore, simply asking how your day went is insufficient. About getting specifics and diving more deeply into them, if she says she had experiencing a challenging day at work, is not limited to saying something like, that sucks, showing understanding, and if you're intrigued, asking about her most memorable experience. How did you handle the difficult part? These questions demonstrate your interest in her. Not only are they paying attention, but they are also showing interest. When she went through things, her feelings and thoughts, this is what makes you unique. From the crowd, here's another pro tip. What she says is often overlooked by most men. Details, but when you can remember something she talked about, talk about it. She'll feel like you. Really care. Let's say she talks about an upcoming work project that brings her joy. When you next speak with her, inquire about her progress. It turned out that one small thing made her a sense of being understood, valued and important. It only takes a moment to demonstrate your commitment to her, different than what you're getting, paying attention to what's important to her. She tells you this while you're on a date. Let's say it's her favorite thing to do. Cooking, instead of giving her in general, that's fine. Go deeper and add. What's your best thing to cook or eat? You have a favorite memory. Preparing food. This method starts a chat and makes her feel like she's being with someone. You reveal a part of yourself when you respond. There are serious follow-up questions. You're not just making small talk, setting up a link skill too. Keep your cool. To be honest, life is full of ups and downs. Dates have their ups and downs too. 
A guy is the thing that turns women off the most. Who gets upset over little things? Something happens while you're on a day date. Things don't go as planned. Perhaps the food is to blame. Takes too long or puts you next to a loud group instead of getting angry. Take this opportunity to impress her. Not bothered by little things takes away from the guy who can keep his cool. Even laughing about it demonstrates your maturity and mentality. And women like being in charge of things. Very much. Having a beautiful calm is all about what do you do when things get tough? It's about being the kind of guy who doesn't let outside factors in. Decide how he feels when you stay calm and cool. You show her that you are calm and collected. She can trust in you. She won't fall apart under it. It's not often that pressure stays this steady. It's certainly something that draws people to think about it with you. Would you prefer to be with someone who understands, upset about every little setback, or someone who will always be there for you? This skill works really well when the situation doesn't unfold as expected. People have reported that she frequently arrives late for dates. Maybe there was a lot of traffic, or she couldn't find a place to park instead of feeling bad about it. Stay calm, and when you demonstrate your understanding to her, you're not bothered by small failures. It makes you feel safe and at ease. She will perceive you as a stable adult, someone who doesn't bother about little things, and every woman does that. Consider the following scenario, nice place, and the service is less quickly than expected instead of whether you're complaining or expressing your frustration. If you're angry, make fun of it. We learn more from activities such as, guess this, it's time to communicate effectively by maintaining a positive attitude. Your attitude has the potential to be annoying into something that people will remember. You'll seem like someone she can trust. Regardless of the challenges he faces, being sure of yourself is a magnetic skill. Not as much, but here's something a lot. Many guys make the mistake of thinking they need to keep every silence with words. She was intrigued, but here's the reality. It's sometimes better to say less, more powerful than speaking. The guy who knows how to hold those who back him up a little and being there for him makes him stand out in a world where everyone else is trying to say less and be the loudest. Let her lean in to show interest. I am here to assist you and complete your tasks. When you talk less in a chat and notice that you're actively collecting details about her, how people react to her hobbies and even her mood, this gives you a huge. You are smart and capable of making your own decisions. Based on what she's showing you, for instance, if she says she hikes a lot, you can talk about that later. You could even suggest a hike for later. When you're just watching, you can detect these things when you converse. Use the details to create something unique. Another type of observation is based on experience. To keep control, you need to know when to let go. She wants to share more details about herself with you. Please pay close attention when you give her the instructions. You're giving her room to talk, share parts of herself with you. Doing this independently fosters trust and comfort, which of course led to attraction. So when you reunite with her, take your time. Fill every void, lean back and watch. Allow her to reveal her true self and you will be amazed. I am shocked at how much more attractive you are. Becoming the center of interest. Let's say you're seated beside her and she's discussing her recent trip to another country. Instead of speaking for yourself, let her talk about her trip stories and smile and really interested in her. She'll notice that you are letting her speak and the respect will mean a lot to her. The amount of attention you're giving at some point, she'll probably ask you about yours. Goes on trips, but she's already feeling like you care about her. In your story, you set up a situation where she feels important and valued just by being aware and talking less savvy to handle your emotions and feelings. One of the things that makes a man look good is having feelings in relationships. Run high.
there's fun and interest look forward to, but there can also be anger, resentment, and having trouble understanding how you deal with them. From her perspective, these emotions encapsulate your true essence. If you're the kind of guy who takes off, the handle snaps at the slightest hint of trouble, not only looks bad, but you're also setting up a place where she feels dangerous. But if you're the man who can stay cool, someone who can handle their feelings, do not allow them to dictate your actions. You're building a basis for behavior. Your trust and safety are in charge. Emotions aren't something to hide. It's up to you to decide how to react. Consider taking a deep breath before acting, about giving your answer some thought. Avoid allowing anger or rage to overcome you. Take over women like guys who can stay. Calm in a variety of ultimate events. It demonstrates your strength and maturity. Emotional control communicates to your body, not driven by urges that you'll be able to deal with the difficulties of life. This makes you someone special to grace. You can rely on someone to not do so. Lose it every time something goes wrong, like a comment about another guy or something from her. Instead of becoming angry or jealous, focus on the past or anger. Stay calm. Maybe even you can either laugh it off or ask her more about it from a place of real. This surprising answer shows that you're curious. Self-assurance and safety. You're showing that you don't feel scared by little things that make you feel it is stable and gives you a sense of satisfaction. You possess a rare trait. This will help you stand out. On a date, and she brought up a you might occasionally see your ex-boyfriend feel unsafe or angry, but here's where you can shine instead of having others do it for you. If it bothers you, stay calm and say, Oh, that's cool. What did you guys do? By keeping calm, you can do things together. Show that you're safe and not impacted. She'll be impressed by how grown up you are. You can tell how at ease you are with yourself. Skill 5 Choose who you love. Love and receiving love are wonderful experiences and tools, but if you give them away for free, think about it. They lose value. Anything that is too simple to get quickly loses its charm. The same is true for when you give her your full attention, money, time, and care. She hasn't done anything to deserve it. You might even feel like it's too much, but when you pick and choose yours, it sends a clear message that you care about them. Thank you for your time and care. You don't just give them away. Being selective about who you love doesn't work. Avoiding gaming implies prioritizing your own time and not being scared to pull. Take a step back and live your life without her. Do the things you enjoy and make time for them. You're not always with your friends. She'll enjoy the moments when they're available. Spending more time together has a significant impact, a sense of secrecy and thrill, as she'll look forward to the times when she has your full attention right now. A selective method keeps things in check and stops the relationship from a feeling. Remember, attraction is often on one side. It grows in the time between events. Being close all the time while you're always available it's too simple for her to not care about you, but if she has to, it needs a little work to get your attention. It makes every moment with you feel unique. She will enjoy the time you spend with her. It's evident that your time is valuable. You possess valuable items that you don't discard. Lightly, this balance makes a movement. It's engaging and manageable. Let's say you're talking back and forth. She wants to hang out with you the following day instead of letting her know when everything is ready. You have plans, but think about another day. This little thing shows her that you're not always ready to meet her. You're showing her in a subtle way that you have your own plans and that life is important to her. I'm going to have to work hard to be part of it, which involves being picky about your preferences. Every time you make her feel like she's working toward a good cause, that makes the link a lot stronger. Better skills. 6. Make mystique. 
Let's talk about making myth. This skill is strong because it means keeping some of yourself just out of reach. Consider it when you feel overwhelmed, is shown. There's nothing left to find out and get rid of the riddle. But when you leave some things up to speculation, slowly you show parts of yourself. Women are becoming more and more interesting. They're naturally interested and pulled to men who don't tell you everything at once. When Mystique makes you interesting, she'll always feel like there's more. I am eager to learn more about you, and this wish keeps her interested in making Mystique. To hide who you are is not the same thing. Sharing yourself at the right time is beneficial. People often think that having everything clear from the start is a better link, but it's all too often that makes things feel old or embrace a bit of surprise instead of expecting it. If she asks about your weekend, don't say anything. Don't feel the need to describe everything. Everything you said or did was intended to hint. Consider one intriguing aspect and depart from the rest. The rest of this makes her wonder which is what you want from mystery stays. People were interested, especially when she understood that she doesn't possess all of you. I thought about what to say if she asked. You're really interested in instead of getting out all the details. Say something like, I like a few things, but I'm always to see what sticks. Try something new. It's unclear, but interesting, leading her to learn more about this method. It makes people feel excited about becoming someone by getting to know yourself. She wants to slowly become public instead of all at once. Every exchange turns into, she has the opportunity to learn some new things. Further, she will appreciate the gradual escalation. Discovery skill. Set priorities. Let's talk more about why growth matters. Prioritizing your personal growth is crucial. The most beautiful things about you. Grow and think about this. A man who invests money in himself and is always learning, getting better and working towards something. It follows that bigger is not the same as the other women see this because very few people navigate life alone. Autopilot performs the same tasks repeatedly every day, but when you make it, you show her that you care about her growth. You're not satisfied with good enough. You are someone who wants to do well, who is driven, and what is that drive? that not only makes women want you, it prepares you for a better life. Putting growth first doesn't mean you have to be extreme or perfect. That's what it's about. Making steady growth in the areas that are most important to you, whether it's your job, your health or your mind, is all important. It's crucial for your health and relationships. It is important to have a clear picture of who you want to be and to turn into and take steady steps to get there when you're really excited about it. It comes from you, self-improvement. The way you care for yourself is important. The way you speak and behave around others is important. Other people are important. A man is dedicated to his work. Own growth doesn't have to show. He shows his commitment through what he does. Amounts, let's say you're working on a specific project that challenges and thrills you like. Developing a new skill is crucial for a business. A skill or course, F, or when you talk about competition with her, tell her about the trip, not just the end goal. Say something like, I'm not there yet. I love seeing how much I've grown every day. The way you think shows her that you've made a commitment to stay in it for an extended period. You can stick with it for a long time, and you know how to don't give up, even when things are difficult. A lot of tough women look up to and respect this of strength and commitment, especially when it's in your best interest to do so. Take care of yourself, not just to gain the approval of others. Growth isn't just about reaching certain goals. Goals are a way of life. You want to grow and are open to new things. Experiences, new points of view and new thoughts you're always having changing and this change makes you lively, keeps things interesting because each day unveils a fresh aspect of yourself. 
She hasn't seen it yet, but it's consistently present. Progress that keeps her interested. She knows you won't do that kind of thing. Sit down or stay the same. You're always getting better at being yourself. And that's really rare. Let's move on to something else. As you grow, you don't just date better. It aids in achieving success in all aspects of your life. Grow when you're in any area of your life. Getting ready to deal with life's problems and the strength to face them. New chances with confidence and to think about every situation with ways to learn. This improvement isn't just pretty. It gives you power. And when she sees that, you're not only achieving your personal objectives, creating excitement among those around you motivates you. She desires to assist and participate in someone's life. To say that you're looking for a difficult plan to do something like run a race or learn, a new language emerges when you discuss it. Talk about more than just the end result. To talk about the things you're picking up. Talk about the focus it requires. What went wrong and how are you handling it? Getting through them shows her that you're not just about getting there. You value the journey, and that journey shapes who you are. She'll think of you as someone who's always changing and trying to become someone else who is strong and dedicated, and that's an incredibly beautiful eight important skills. Value your time. Something you can't get back, and what you do with it, demonstrates your level of commitment. Take care of yourself and your goals. When you value your time, you make it clear that you're someone with a goal and high standards is needed. They are dealing with something else in their lives. Wait for other people to tell you what to do. Women like guys who treat them with respect. Time because it shows they have a reason when you're picky about what and where you spend your time. Showing her that you care about her. Your plans. And don't waste time. Spend time on things that don't fit yours. Value your time, but that doesn't mean this is due to your constant busy schedule or your lack of approachability. About making rules and following them. It's about letting them know that every minute you give someone or something should be used for something, but that doesn't mean being rude or selfish indicates a lack of self-awareness. Planned when she sees that you're someone who doesn't give in to fear. Who knows when to say no to distractions? Things that don't need your attention, she'll think of you as a man who knows what he's doing. This sense of self-worth is that she respects you for spreading the word, Consider this further. She expresses a desire to connect. It's late, but you've already made plans. You can either work independently or visit. Go to the gym instead of leaving everything behind. You say, I'd love to see. I'm sorry, but I need to do something. Finish first and let's choose a time that works for you. This demonstrates to her that it benefits both of us equally. You keep the promises you make, and you don't simply discard your plan. It's not about playing. You have to work hard to get what you want. You care about your time and goals, and she will enjoy the time she does have. I value your time even more now. Living goes hand in hand with consciously when you're conscious. You have choices to make. How do you spend every day, every hour? Right now, you're not just going. By going through the steps, you're making changes in your life. Being focused is appealing, because it's evident that you're not simply floating. As they await events, you feel in charge and can concentrate. Ensure your life aligns with your identity, you are who you are and what you want people to do for you. A man who doesn't get sidetracked easily and who doesn't get caught in every chance or request, but instead he carefully considers each option and ensures it. Let's align LS with his goal. Perform the same task every day, such as a morning routine. Exercise or dedicate time to self-improvement. If she instructs you to skip it, Follow her instructions. Something else, 
being nice, tell her. You value that part of your day and that you want to see her afterward. This small thing shows focus, pride in yourself. It demonstrates that you're promised to do the things that make you unique, better, and she'll see that being with you means being with someone who's not only focused but also deliberate about how, as he gets better at this level of focus, it highlights your uniqueness. You should be aware of your destination. She will want to be in charge. Half of skill nine, show thanks. Happiness and gratitude are two of those things. Things that can totally alter how others perceive you may not always be positive. Easy, but being truly thankful can stand out when you're thankful for the things you have. They're a sign that you're stuff that you're not always seeking more of, yet I can appreciate what I already have. In front of you, women are attracted to men who are happy and can find joy in little things. At times, showing thanks isn't about avoiding issues or acting like life is great. It's about recognizing the people who value what's good in their lives are naturally drawn to good vibes, and women are especially drawn to guys who make them feel good. It's not always about having a good attitude. It's not about being happy or cheery. When things don't go your way, you must remain strong. How do you feel when people complain or get upset? Being negative is a big turn-off, but if you can find amusement in the minor mishaps that occur in life, maintain a positive attitude and focus on the positive aspects. Show a rare level of personal strength. Being thankful makes you strong because it helps you remember what's important when she will feel at ease with you. She is with someone who's stable and doesn't get shook up by small things setbacks and who really enjoys living. Let's say you're with her and an alteration or a minor issue arises. In plans, instead of getting upset, say something like, I guess we've, we had a little adventure here. What you do shows that you're flexible and can enjoy life. Even when things don't go as planned, I feel calmer around you because your positive vibes will make her feel positive as if nothing is ever a problem, and when think about how beneficial it will make her feel. People are happier and more respected when you're around. If you're still here, well done. You're already ahead of 99% of people are out there, and you have, they demonstrated, their toughness. She is interested in learning more about wisdom and understanding. Here's an additional skill for you. You get the bonus skill 10 in money being independent. And finally, let's talk about security. Independence and security with money. Extra skill that makes a huge difference in how do women perceive your wealth. Stable isn't about showing off your money or an attempt to impress with things. You need to show that you're, you are responsible for what you are in charge of in your life and what you can do. Taking care of your own money. Being free doesn't just mean having a steady income, depends on how you manage it. Make wise investments to increase your wealth, and making plans for the future when a woman makes sure you're financially stable. It shows wisdom and dependability, traits that are very attractive. Take a look at financial independence. It's not just about money. Having freedom and safety when you're, if you have enough money, you're free from the worry and stress that come with. If your finances are unstable, make decisions based on what's best for you, not what you can pay for at the... As soon as women see this, they I respect a man who has a strong foundation. Money demonstrates your responsibility. A man who has enough money doesn't he requires assistance from someone else. That being self-sufficient is very attractive if she suggests a trip. If that costs too much, don't feel awful about it. They felt as though they had to give it their all. Something you can afford. That's just as fun, say, I'd love to do. Let's do something a little less flashy. Don't use that idea until it's truly effective, worth it. This won't make you look, it's cheap. It makes you look useful. It shows that you're not grounded. You have made rash decisions with your money. Women like guys who think things through. 
This is because it shows how you think about the long term, which is something that someone who can deal with life's problems. Being responsible, we've looked into some of the most important social skills are discussed here. One that will help you stand out by we are focusing on traits that are important. These aren't straightforward fixes or surface level changes. Tricks are important parts of being a good person. When done regularly, they change how you, how you talk to people and how they see you. Women are interested in men who are steady, people who are sure of themselves and have a strong sense of self-worth when you learn these things. The mystery of active listening and composure growth, time management, happiness, and if you have financial responsibility, you're not just getting women to like you, you're getting better at being yourself. These skills help you in more ways than one. They improve your life when you go on dates. I hope this was helpful to you. We'd love it if you joined our video. Channel memberships or hitting that the subscribe button allows us to continue creating high quality content and share it with guys who are serious about growth. Your help makes all the. Before you leave, please inform us about any differences. Which skill do you think is most important? Will have the biggest impact on your life. Let's hear your thoughts. Remember, every step you take to improve yourself is a step toward becoming that person you're truly meant to be. Thank you. Watching.